Nelly puts his father on blast after taking care of him for 20 years, but also, in a positive note, uplifts his mother in a positive post about his mother. I think it's more, his dad must have done something to him that made him want to cut him off. Um, you know, it, it happens, okay? You know, my, my father's not the best father in the world either, so it's like... You're supposed to, you know, you love your father to a certain extent, but then it's also like, okay, this guy really doesn't give a shit about me, you know? Like, that's how my father is with me, you know? It's like, uh, so it's like, I can relate to this. You know, my mother has always been the one to be there for me and everything, and my father's just been like, you know, they do the minimum, you know? And it doesn't affect me another way, because you know, I'm, I'm, I'm my own person, just like everybody is, and you can't let that stuff, you know, you just got to be feel blessed that you're here. Uh, anyway, so Nelly gets into, he says, the word father is a strong word, something I knew uh, anything about as a child, because mine did what he had to do, only what he wanted. That's what he said. Mine never did what he had to do, only what he wanted. Okay, so hope it was all worth it, pops. I'm done with you. No more money for me. Let them pay your bills. So I guess Nelly was paying his father's bills for 20 years um, after he made it. He said, uh, just because it's your DNA, don't make you a father. Mine never saw me play sports, never taught me anything, never saw me graduate, and I still took care of him for almost 20 years. He never took care of me for half of that. Until this day, he still does whatever he wants, though. I pay his bills. Well, used to. That's over tonight. So then uh, Nelly goes into uh, his fa- his mother, right? He's, he talks about how his mother was always there for him. Um, you know, she was the one to go to his games and everything. And, you know, that's positive, man. You know, my mom... Um, did the same for me. Uh, you know, she was always there when I needed her. Um, he said, you don't see my mama. Uh, you don't see my mama. Should have known she was the one that hold it down. She always had a job, came to my game, saw her son graduate, saw me score my first touchdown, bought me my first pair of J's, wiped my tears away when I lost the big game and taught me how to play sports. Mama's boy. He said, shout out to all the mamas. I didn't put this one in there. I got to put this up. He said, shout out to all the mamas. Had to be fathers for the kids. To my mama who taught me. Oh, hold on. Let me get back to it. Sorry. I covered it up by accident. Who taught me how to catch play ball. Took me to my game. Borrowed money to buy me cleats. And stood up and cheered when I walked the stage. I love you, mama. I get it now. Totally. You know, Nelly is a good father himself. Uh... I see he raised his kids. I mean, those are his kids, yeah. <laughs> but uh, he has kids, and, you know, yeah, he showed his mom a lot of love here, and that's important, man. Uh, I have a good mother, too. I can relate. My mom was always there for me. My father wasn't, but it's all good. Nellie has a great family, good life. Anyways, guys, hey, we ended on a positive note. I'll keep you guys up to date today. This is George Tower with JT News. Hit that bell, hit the subscribe button, and if you want to add to the channel, it's George Tower Media at gmail.com. I'll check you guys later. Peace.